Howdy everyone, it's General Heat here. How is everyone doing today? So for today's video, we're going to be uh, revisiting an old video I did back in January uh, where I tackled the question of can you get away with killing Hitler on Wolfenstein 2? And just as a refresher, uh, during this part on a mission, on a Venus mission, where you're supposed to uh, pretend to be an actor and fool everyone into thinking that you're a famous movie star, there's a scene here where you're supposed to go um, do a bit more auditioning. Uh, and you have a brief moment here where you actually have the option to kill Hitler. Now, of course, if you actually do that, you're not supposed to during this part of the mission, but if you actually do that, everyone in the room suddenly turns against you and starts shooting at you and killing you. And uh, in that video, uh, I, tried a f I tried quite a few things to survive. Uh, I, but in that video, I basically showed you there's pretty much nowhere in this room where you can hide that you can survive uh, getting shot at by everybody else. Because their shots are basically instant kill. I even went on the PC version and turned on, uh, used some mods like infinite health and infinite armor. But even with infinite health, the uh, all the bullets and all the melees are still one shot kill. The only thing I could do was hide behind uh, this lady here where you could kind of survive a little longer. But ultimately, even with mods, I could not survive. But now there's actually a new mod, um, a new mod tool called Infinity, which is actually has a, has a bunch of trainers in it. Um, for a, a lot of games. It's from the people who made Horizon uh, for the 360, which is another mod tool. But anyways, with that mod, there's um, there's a certain feature called, um, which, which disables AI weapons. And as you can see, what that does is with disable AI weapons, none of the AIs shoot at me, except for the giant robo which shoots the fire. But for some reason, the fire doesn't count as instant kill, which uh, I guess in this case, my infinite health helps enough. So... AIs can't shoot me. Their melees are still one hit kill though, but as long as I don't let the melee at me, then it's fine. So what's interesting now is I can actually like trick that robot into like swinging while the uh, its allies are nearby. And you can actually kill some of the soldiers um, in this room. And what's interesting there, as you just saw, is once they're dead, they do drop armor and weapons, but you still cannot pick up any weapons on this mission. Uh, nor can you actually bring out any weapons or use any weapons. You will remain unarmed the entire time, even when I modded it so that I survive and uh, to the point where I'm able to trick the robot into killing some of its allies. Uh, but yeah, so uh, that's basically um, that's basically what this new mod does. <laughs> it lets you uh, lets you avoid being shot at during this mission. Um, obviously, it's used um, on other missions to cheat the game, <laughs> but uh, yeah, so with this mod, we, we can basically get away with killing Hitler. Because uh, we don't die and the flames don't kill us. And as long as we don't get too close, then uh, the, the robot won't hit us. And of course, we can even kill some enemies on this mission further. Because, uh, you know, we never knew if it was possible to kill the enemies on this mission. But now we know they actually are killable. Uh, obviously, I have no way of killing the robot. Um, but other than that, you know, everything else is... Almost everything else is killable. This actor here has no reaction. Nobody, nobody else really has any reaction to you killing Hitler, other than the initial like uh, the lady shouting, and then the ro and then the soldiers all going uh, freaking out over it. But that's about it. And the other actor, as you just saw, he just sits there. Now, unfortunately, even if you kill Hitler, uh, you s you can't finish the mission anymore. Even if you mod it so that you can't be so that enemies don't shoot you, you can still be killed because their shots are one hit kill, even with infinite health and infinite armor combined. But now, you can uh, at least explore around and even try to get them to kill each other. Um, the robot will kill a few, a few of the soldiers, but these over here, they can't get over that, um, <laughs> that roped uh, entrance. It's, it's, like, it's like some kind of barrier that they can't cross that's impossible. So you can't bring these soldiers to the robot. Uh, but you can't get them to hit each other, but it's really hard to get them to kill each other because... Um, you might accidentally get hit by them, and their melee hits are still one Mr. one hit kill. Uh, but yeah, so that is getting away with killing Hitler. Not entirely, of course, but just enough that you can explore around, and you know, uh, I guess <laughs> in your mind, you can uh, you can say that you killed Hitler and you saved the world and saved America and everything. Happily, everyone lived happily ever after, <laughs> sort of. Um, but yeah, so no way to get to that door. I don't, there's no no clip mods or anything that I know of at the moment that I can use to get to the door. And even if I could get to the door, I don't think it would do anything. But I don't know. 
it's uh, just an interesting little fun thing to do and just a little follow up to that video because with that video I said that even with mods you can't survive but now you can and actually if you guys are interested I'll post the link to that mod in the uh, the link it, that mod tool is actually pretty great it's it covers like a lot of PC games so definitely check it out if you guys want but other than that if, if you guys enjoyed this video you know make sure to leave a like uh, leave your thoughts and comments just anything else you want me to check out just uh, let me know and I'll do my best to look into it as always but other than that, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.